Well, welcome to the first part of the Three Lochs Way, one of Scotland's great walking trails. Um, this one's not that long, it's about 34 miles uh, in total. And um, today we're just doing about eight miles between here, Balloch and Helensborough. This is one of these walking trails that, as I think we'll see, offers pretty wonderful scenery. The sort of scenery that Scotland is famous for. This is the first of those lochs, Loch Lomond, and the other two are the Gaird Loch and Loch Long. So, if you're ready for an adventure, then let's go. That's a steep break. Um, for the camera, <laughs> nice colourful coats. Well, it's to keep the flies off. <laughs> <laughs> I'll need to get one of them. <laughs> they look crazy, but hopefully they do the trick. For the Cleggs, yeah. <laughs> Lovely old road this. Made solid, if not fiddly, <laughs> with a lot of stones. And I think they used to use this as a, a, a route to carry coffins. Uh, I've forgotten exact details, but I'll, I'll fill you in with the details at some point. I was following behind these horses there in their brightly coloured coats to keep the flies off apparently which seems like a good idea because that last walk I was out in uh, uh, Drumclog Moor had a couple of clegg bites sometimes you don't feel clegg bites and, but after a day or two you can see them big red dots they can get a little bit angry
I am in my element. <laughs> you have no idea. I think I may have said this before, but sometimes when you make the effort to get out, it invariably pays dividends. I mean, I've been pretty fed up the last couple of days. As we're all told at the moment, it's okay to feel fed up. And given what we've all been through in the last few months, it's hardly surprising. And I really did have to make an effort to get out today. I just I couldn't really be bothered. But oh, I am so glad I did. I mean, it's just absolutely wonderful. And this is just, it's, I've been on this kind of route once before, and this is quite different to how it was when I was last here. I think the last time I was on this bit, all the trees had just been felled and the whole place had a look of desolation about it. But clearly a, a new forest has been planted. The, the trees are still young, but it looks green again and doesn't feel desolate. Um, from here, well, if, I, if my memory serves me well, because we're still, although we're on the Three Locks Way, at this point we're still uh, also on the, the John Muir Way, which we will leave at some point, then head down into Hel Hillsborough. Um, at this point, I think we've got some stairs, I hate stairs, but never mind, stairs into that forest there, and then we'll go up onto a hill, I think it's Gout Hill which is actually just off the track of the trail. Um, 277 metres above sea level. And um, from there, <laughs> uh, we'll get another view of Loch Lomond, the first of the lochs on this great walking trail. And then we'll drop down the side of Ben Bowie. And I think we're still at that stage on the Stony Mullen Road. Into Helensborough. If I was up to giving a hop, skip and a jump, I would do it. The deep dark forest. If, you, if I hear another tree creak, I might well break into a sprint. Because I've got very, very shallow roots and they fall over at the drop of a hat. It's quite an atmospheric bit of woodland, this. You know, one, the, the trees are very close, uh, which is keeping out quite a lot of light, and it's also quite steep. A bit out of breath. Well, it is steep, you know. Even when I was young, I would get out of breath on steep bits. But all this sitting about in the house for months on end, drinking beer and eating food, and doing nothing much but playing computer games and watching the telly. I could be turning into a fat slob. Whoa. Jesus. Right.
just a short distance after that dark wood you'll see a, a post with some uh, directional arrows on it one point towards a viewpoint I would highly recommend that you go up onto that viewpoint because this is what you get an absolutely stunning view of Loch Lomond Ben Lomond and I've got my bonny purple heather I'm ready for anything Well, this seemed like a good place to stop for a for a bit of a rest. A perfectly positioned boulder. And we've got our final destination in view. Helensborough, just over there. What a great walk it's been. What a great day it's been. I thoroughly enjoyed it. I mean, I've done parts of this walk before, years ago, but sometimes you forget just how stunning some things are. And uh, it doesn't get better than this, it really doesn't. So, um, I'm going to end the video here. We just kind of head downhill here. I think we join a major road and head into Helensburgh from there. Um, and that was part one of the Three Lochs Way, one of Scotland's truly wonderful walking trails. And I hope you'll join me for part two, which will be between uh, Helensborough and Gearlock Ed. I'm Eddie Burns. I'll see you again.